Hey, welcome. How are you doing? I hope you're having an amazing day. Thank you so much for joining me in today's episode of the Not So Berry Challenge. If you like my content, please don't forget to leave a like, share your thoughts in the comment section, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very, very much. Make sure to check out my other Let's Play The Werewolves as well. It has been a really, really fun series, and I'm enjoying it just as much as I'm enjoying the Not So Berry Challenge. Today is a episode I've been waiting for a long, long time. Omaira is finally going to get the wedding ceremony with Trace on. However, we do know that it is probably not going to end up well. So I would say let's just get this show on the road and see what's going to happen. Okay, right now we know that Omaira isn't doing so well. Um... Yeah, she's in a PR crisis because she didn't help the llama or llama was some kind of was involved in some kind of way. I don't remember exactly what happened. Chris Zess thinks Omaira Berry is swell and wants to become best friends. We know that Chris is indeed her very, very good friend, but we also know that she finds him quite attractive. Let's enthuse with him about marriage make joke about marriage we did assign him to be our officiant at the wedding however i'm not gonna be able to do a wedding with my wedding stories back simply because we don't have the leave at the wedding uh, oh my god don't fight with him no yeah simply because we aren't going to have the option to leave a trace at the altar which is really really sad but we are going to have to do it the old way. Plus, I did download a mod that is going to help me because I'm not 100% sure I can do it the old way either. But yeah, you know, it is what it is. Oh yeah, but I was talking about Chris. So Chris is a really, really good friend of ours, but Omaira does find him attractive. He is married, so right now she is definitely not going to make any advances, but who knows, somewhere along the way, what's gonna happen. Omaira woke up from a nap and decided to eat her wedding cake. Omaira, if this isn't a sign, I don't know what is. She was like, eh, who cares about the wedding, I really want to eat that cake right now. Like, couldn't you just wait until tomorrow? No? Okay. I feel like Omaira is definitely going to use tonight to really think about what Trace said in the last episode. And it was he's really unsure about Omaira working so hard. He really wants Omaira to spend more time with her family. Oh, I forgot to make myself smaller. Of course I did. Thankfully, I noticed it. Trace is back from work and he's feeling really tense. I think he's really excited about the wedding. We also saw Trace and Omaira get really closer in the last episode. They kind of rekindled their relationship. So Trace thinks everything is fine and he just wants everything to turn out perfectly tomorrow. So that's the only reason why he is tense right now. Let's see what Omaira is doing. Oh, she's quite tired. Plus, she has a low fun. Maybe you can watch some television before going to sleep. Even though watching TV, I'm not sure how fun it's going to be for you. Work would probably be more fun. Oh, and we can maybe post a selfie and work on your fame points as, as well. I really want her to be more famous. It's the Instagram story. Thank you very much. A politician is famous so especially someone who wants to become a president oh Maira needs to secure two votes uh okay uh, we should we cannot secure from anyone a vote right now maybe we can try from trace i wonder if he's going to do it if he's going to help our cause political career secure vote thanks to a strong command of the issues a conf a confident demeanor and maybe just a few empty promises. Omaira successfully secured Trace's vote. Oh my god, but right after that he got into a fight with Omaira. He was like, wait, I thought you would stop with that. What's up with you trying to get a vote right now? Which is probably just another thing she's going to talk, uh, think about. She just cannot understand what's going on right now. What is his problem? I won't give up 
all of my career because of him. But you know, she already planned a lot of things for the wedding, so she doesn't want to give it up now. Maybe she changes her mind until tomorrow morning. But yeah, right now it's time for her to go to sleep. She's really tired. Grace, why aren't you tired? Oh my god, he's set. Passionless job. From fear of dead end job. Oh, I'm so sorry, Trace. Maybe you'll get more luck once you move out of this place. Oh, it's Melissa's birthday today. Melissa is officially going to become an elder. Let's just ignore that she had already elder, elder skin details. I was preparing her. And I actually fooled myself. I thought she was an elder already. Since Peter is already awake, I think the appropriate thing would be for their wedding day is to cook something for the family. He doesn't know about all of the drama behind the scenes, so he is going to want to make something nice for the whole family. But he is also sad because his little daughter is getting married. He never thought that this day would come. Oh, and he's missing family. You're going to see all of them today, don't you worry. Uh, Peter, are you going to eat it by yourself? Um, okay, I thought you would wait for the whole family, but you do you. Maybe you can eat later with them again. Uh, we need to take care of your hygiene. Oh my god, Omaira woke up and she's doing really, really ter terrible. And on her wedding day, like, what is this? Oh, and this house is so empty, I'm gonna have to do something about it. I'm waiting for some kind of inspiration, but it's just, but it just isn't coming. We all know me and building definitely not best friends or are not friends at all. Wait, I finally got all three generations in one shot. I definitely need to take a picture because I don't think we see it very often. It's so cool. Oh, wait, what? Can we see the resemblance? Like I can definitely see the high cheeks on Malisa and Omaira. I still don't see much on Nora, but I'm pretty sure she's going to have them as well. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add... Wait, first we can invite some guests over. I think I'm going to invite over Eliza. She's going to be the one that's going to spend some time with Omaira and Malisa before the wedding. Kind of help Malisa, uh, Omaira prepare. And we'll imagine that the guys are, I don't know, drinking or whatever. Oh, we can also invite Roven, of course. He needs to come. And all the other guests are going to come to the wedding location. Um, What can't you do? You don't have space to invite your brother over? Huh? That's the most stupid thing I have ever seen. Honestly, can you invite over? What? I'm confused. I'm very confused. But anyways, let's invite Eliza at least in. And we are going to add her into the group. And of course, um, uh, Malisa. Oh my god, I am not so good with names today. We can see that Eliza already changed her outfit and is congratulating, congratulating Malisa on her daughter's wedding. Let's have Malisa now also change into her formal there we go. Oh my god, Melissa, you don't have to be mischievous today, please. And now let's see how Omaira looks in her wedding dress. There we go, the beautiful bride. I think right now she's also going to talk to Eliza about the wedding. And she's also going to express doubts about it. It's gonna be like, uh, the wedding is today, but Trace is saying all of those crazy things and I'm not sure what I should do. Could you please give me a ice? And Eliza is gonna be like, if you don't like him, if he's trying to tell you to do something you don't want to do, just leave his ass. Am I allowed to say that? All <laughs> while Melissa is posting on Instagram about her daughter's wedding. So after everything that's happened in the past few days, plus Eliza's advice, probably also her mother's advice, Omaira is kind of trying to figure out what is the best thing to do. Should she compromise with Trace or simply go her own way, where she feels it is the right way? But she's like, 
I've come so far, I've prepared everything, I cannot let everyone down. Listen, you can do it, Omaira, you can do it. Less hours, uh, it's not a problem. I mean, it's not that I'm tense now because I'm not working. I simply cannot stop thinking about my work, but it's fine, it's going to get less intense, right? I'm probably only thinking about my job because Trace mentioned it. And then she's like, oh, but then again, I really do love my job. I don't know what to do. But the time has come for us to travel to the party. I think I'm going to plan a... No, I don't want to plan a wedding event, but I'm going to travel with a few people, uh, with a few sims. Nora is going to stay home now. We are going to get a nanny. And we've got the whole group here. I hope no one changes into their... Uh, they shouldn't into their summer outfit it's not even summer can we bring them all, all here and can i have any wedding interactions or any like give toast maybe without a wedding because this is not a official event i'm not sure how official i can make it for the interaction for the main interaction to work but we are going to imagine this is a well-planned, beautiful ceremony with our loved ones. Okay, at least the father can give a toast. Can we also... Oh, we can probably also serve food. Let's do that. Serve all. Yes, thank you. Um, Peter? Okay, he's toasting to the bride and the groom. Let's see if every, everyone is going to take a glass of champagne. I don't think... They, oh, they are... Oh, that's cool. Okay, we do have some kind of a wedding after all. Just not the very, very official one. Oh, Trace is missing work. What? Uh, we are not going to answer the phone because this is probably his boss. I didn't know that he's working today. I'm sorry, Trace. Since I am already here, I'm going to secure the vote from Eliza as well. We do need the two votes. And tomorrow is Omaira's work day. Yes, it is. Yes. Where is Trace? Is, oh, who is she? Did she just flirt with Peter? Eliza. He was basically your adoptive father. I am sure Eliza is going to say yes. Yes, we have secured her vote. And thankfully, Trace did not see it. I think it's time. Can we sit, everyone? I don't think we can, right? Let's have them all sit together. See if this is going to work. But anyways, uh, Trace, what are you doing? Let's get married to Omaira Berry. Let's get this huge event on the... Oh my god, what did you change out of your outfit? Please. There we go. What? Did she just do it autonomously? This was a spoiler alert, but let's check it out. Like, I didn't press anything. Nothing. Omaira obviously really didn't want it, but let's watch it. Oh my gosh, she's like, you know what? No, I don't want this. I don't want you deciding what I'm going to do in my life. I'm taking control and I definitely don't want this. Terrible match. It's probably best to stay apart. There's, there's a lot of dislike here, here, like a lot. So yeah, I think Trace, the best thing would be for you to go home. And Omaira is probably gonna have some explaining to do to her father because he wasn't expecting this at all. But Peter is absolutely cool with it. He just wants his daughter to be happy. Of course, he is shocked, and as we can see, he also has to post it on social media. But he is still very supportive. Omaira, why don't you get a hug from your best friend? Banter with old friend first, maybe. If she feels any insecurities, Chris is going to help her feel a lot better. Maybe also deep conversation. And of course, we are going to hug him. You know, Omaira is now also doing damage control. Her reputation is on the line. And she has to talk to everyone. Where is Rowan, our twin brother? Oh, I wanted to greet him. Did he went away? Oh, no. Oh, Melissa, what's wrong? Are you embarrassed? There is nothing you could have done. Listen, 
Omaira is going to find someone who is going to love and appreciate her just the way she is. Or maybe Trace is going to realize one day that he shouldn't really act that way and is going to fight to have her again. Oh my god, and what are these two doing? Are you guys for real? Are you for real? Is this the right time to do that? Yeah, the wedding was called off. Let's just try to learn to play new instruments. That makes a lot of sense. But okay, I think the guests have a left. I think everyone is pretty sh shocked about what happened. And we are going home now as well. And what we are going to do is split the household. It will be time for Trace to leave us. I don't think it would make much sense for them to keep living together. And we know what Omara is going to do now. Focus on her career 1000%. Okay, we are back in the household. And as we can see, Trace is already ready to go. I did give him 39,000 simoleons, he did deserve it. And listen, he had a lot of money once he moved in, so I think he's going to earn a lot of money once he is alone as well. Why can't I get her fun up? Like, it just won't go up, I'm not sure what's going on. Don't we have any more eggs? Eh? What did we already eat? All of it. I don't get it. But let's have then something really cool. Quick, I don't know what we can garden sell it. I don't know. Why is Melissa now mad? Because of her fear. Okay. Oh my god, Omaira hates everything. Listen, Omaira, better days are coming, I promise you. Very soon you can start flirting again, which is going to make me very happy. What preference do you dislike, Omaira? I don't get it. Ooh, a lot of social bunny worthy things happen to Peter. Oh, to Peter. But uh, let's check out Omaira's social bunny. Maybe someone wrote to her. Omaira, I'm so happy I have a friend like you. Thank you so much, Chris. We love you. Oh, and we didn't see Jet in this episode. I'm sure it's because he didn't know where to find us. But okay, I think the best thing right now is for everyone to go to sleep. There is just one thing I want to do and it is send Omaira to work. Oh, and maybe finally try to meet her work colleagues. Because we still haven't met anyone, which is quite disappointing. Grace Cottrell has died. What? Oh my. How did he die? I wasn't expecting that at all. Okay. Um, that happened. Oh, and Malisa aged up. Happy birthday, Malisa. You are now officially an elder. Our generation one is now an elder. But she's still feeling really, really well. Myra just woke up and she isn't really feeling any type of way about Trace passing away. Peter Pumpkin's long life is coming to an end. Oh my god, so much is happening right now. Oh, little baby Nora is sad. Oh, can Melissa maybe help you? Yes, try to hug her. Let's see if we... Oh, what is going on? Where do you have the vacuum from? I'm not sure. Oh, yes, try to console poor Nora. And we are also going to comfort her. I feel so bad for her. But I'm sure Melissa is going to talk a lot to Nora about her father and make sure she never forgets. Oh, Melissa is going to work. Good luck. Uh, not Melissa. Omaira, I have been recording for too long. I think it's time to end this soon. <laughs> oh, we have received the bills that aren't so high. Okay, that's cool. I can definitely solve that. That is not a problem. I thought they would be much higher. But then again, I don't have much things in the house. Like... I don't have many lights. I maybe it's even cheap to live here. Who knows? I definitely don't. <laughs> Lots taxes. Oh, they are the biggest. Power technically nothing. Water technically nothing. One of Myra's co-workers needs help with a task. Help out. Let's see if she's going to meet someone. Myra spends a few minutes tutoring her co-worker. The co-worker ends up doing an adequate job but probably would have done better if Myra had spent a little more time with them. Let's try to spend time with them. And Myra came back from work sadly. 
no promotions today we can see that she's also pretty bummed about it but knowing how determined she is we know that she is going to accomplish a whole lot thank you so much for joining me in today's episode i hope you've enjoyed it i hope it wasn't too chaotic there is a lot more that awaits omaira her love life will just now start to blossom and i'm sure it's going to be really really fun Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you in the next episode. Have a lovely day and goodbye.